quick run through of the Telstar 8. Please excuse my voice, full of cold. So we use the front porch as a kitchen area. I've uh, got these new Outwell cupboards. They've got magnetic fronts on instead of zips, so you can't hear the kids pinching the snacks. Uh, we were running two fridges, both Halfords 45 litres. Uh, fortunately, the blue one has uh, spat the dummy out and it's died this trip. Uh, 15 years of service though, so not too bad. Uh, on the floor in the kitchen, I actually use a caravan awning sheet, ground sheet. Uh, I've cut it down to size, uh, just sealed the edges up with a bit of Gorilla Tape. Uh, and then with a cheap eBay kit, put some eyelets in the corners, just to uh, peg it out a bit. Just done the job. Inside, the all important nighttime, wheeze only toilet. We've gone for the Burgas carpet, which came with the deal. Uh, and we are using the uh, mattress straps in the corners to hold it in, which seems to work really well. It's the first time we've done that. That's pretty good. Um, bedroom setup. Uh, two adults. Uh, what we've done is we've been really greedy. And we've opened up the two pods here to make it into one big double. When the children get a bit older, we'll probably uh, seal it off. This actually zips up completely so it's a, a completely separate pod so we should get a double in the middle and then stick the kid uh, another one of the children one side on the end little pod we've got two beds uh, I think the outworld bazaar can be beds with little five centimeter blow up sims children say they're comfy uh, oh, that'll do us and then we're using a separate pod which you can take out if you wish or you can keep it up. There is a pole that comes with it, so you can turn it into a wardrobe. Um, the only problem with this pod is it does cover half of one of the side doors, uh, which isn't a problem. You can still open the door uh, and vent the tent out, uh, but it keeps them apart. And we have dog bed, uh, just a little table just for all the kids' stuff. Outside, we love this because you can open it up completely if you want. You can get, you do get two king poles. Uh, at the moment, we've just got the side door on the king poles. But you can, if you bought another set of king poles, put both of these front windows up and have those outstretched. Uh, also, this inner door it does open up. Uh, this does all open up all the way to there and there, so you can have a big big open space outside down side brow door it's handy so you can uh, if it's just lightly raining you can keep the keep the side door open let some air in we don't tend to bother with pegging out the sides uh, the guy ropes on the sides obviously if it gets a bit windy we will and on the back you have this huge vent that goes all the way across the back which is zipped, so you can just zip that up at night. It's nice and quick, you don't have to bother messing with guy ropes. Um, obviously the big trailer to get it in, because it's massive. And then again, down the side, there's one side door. Uh, we haven't bothered this trip to, uh, to guy rope the sides out. That's all good. I uh, hope this helps anyone if they're thinking of buying one. I highly recommend it. We went from an Air 8 with a porch. Um, this is quicker to put up, I'd say. Um, you've got the, just five beams all built in. Um, just remember that it is big when it's in the bag. I think someone told me it weighs about eight stone. So uh, make sure you're big and strong. Hope this helps anyone.